So we're looking back a couple weeks at the third meal I cooked with Blue Apron. This is the Tuscan Spiced Cod with Zucchini and Farro. So here you can see we're cutting up the zucchini. This is actually the first time I had cut something up after taking a knife skills class at my office. So you'll see here that I'm a little bit better about not sticking my fingers out, although I've still got more to do, and still making the mistake of sliding that knife along the cutting board that I need to work on. Here you can see we're peeling off that garlic. Now this is before I had really learned the trick to just smashing the garlic on the side. Um, so you can see it took me too long to peel there, but we chopped that up, and so now we've got our zucchini and our garlic. Here we're slicing a lemon. I'm supposed to create a couple of slices of lemon. As you can see, I like have a little bit of trouble figuring out exactly how to get like clean slices of lemon. Um, kind of went from a couple different directions. And then chopped up the peppers for the pepper caper mayo that we're going to be making in a second here, as well as the capers. Uh, capers are small, and so we're just kind of chopping that back and forth with the base of the knife. Next, we're going to take that and combine it with the mayo. This is going to form a kind of topping that we will set alongside of our fish in a little bit. And we'll come over here and we'll work on browning the zucchini. You can see the farro is already in that pot boiling has been the entire time. And we are going to brown up the zucchini for six, seven minutes or eight minutes, I guess is what I set it for here. Uh, so you can see that's just a little bit of zucchini in a pan. We add the garlic in there to add a little bit more flavor to it. Nothing super special just kind of cooking that zucchini away. This is actually, I think, you know, uh, the first six dishes I had from Blue Apron all had zucchini, or five of the six of them had zucchini in it. So this is just one of them. Over there, you can see in the far, we're kind of pulling out that tus that cod, uh, patting it off with the paper towels to give ourselves something a little bit drier, not so much wet stuff in there. It's not too bad because it's vacuum packed, but there's a little bit in, of that stuff in there. Um, I think at this point the farro is finished up, so we'll dump that water off of there and mix the zucchini in with it. So this is kind of going to give us our base that we will use for the Tuscan Spiced Cod. You can see we're adding a little bit of salt and pepper, pepper, pepper there in the background, as well as the Tuscan Spice Mixture, which we will throw on top. Now this cod is actually going to be cooked in the oven. So what we're going to do is put it in aluminum foil. Well, first we will add the farro and the zucchini to the aluminum foil, then put the cod on top. Those will get wrapped up with a little bit of oil as well as those lemon slices that I had trouble cutting earlier, and it will get baked in the oven for 15 minutes inside of those pouches. So those pouches go on a cookie sheet. 15 minutes later, we pull them out. Of course, to fool me, you know, just kind of pulls on that uh, aluminum foil, despite the fact that I just pulled it out of the oven. So not very smart. And the usual problem I have of trying to get all of the food off of my aluminum foil happens again. Here you can see we're juicing the remainder of that lemon, and there's that pepper caper mayo dropping down on the side. Could go on top. I actually put a lot of it on top, but not everyone in my family loves the spice, so I set it on the side. And that's our... Tuscan Spiced Cod with Pepper Caper Mayo, my third meal from Blue Apron. Thanks for watching.